So let's take just a moment to talk about a very commonly used but often wildly misinterpreted score, the grade level equivalent score or GE for short. Now, as you can see in the background, grade level equivalent scores range from 0.0, .0 up to 13. And despite the fact that they seem to mirror the grade levels of school, and even despite the fact that there's a reference to grade levels within the name, it's actually a fairly dangerous thing for us to go too far in directly interpreting this score as explicit references to grade level content or placement. Now, when you're looking to find out more about this or any score uh, in assessments from Renaissance, a great place to go is the technical manual for the particular assessment that you are using. So let's say that I'm working with a sixth grade student and they receive a grade level equivalent score of 10.7. Now, if you take a look at the description of grade level equivalent scores in the tech manual, what it says is, if a student receives a grade level equivalent score of 10.7, this means that the student just scored as well on star reading as the typical student in the 10th grade at the seventh month. So if I'm working with a sixth grade student and they received a 10.7, they did really well. That's how well that they performed. This does not mean, however, that they can read independently on the 10th grade level, that they are ready for all 10th grade content, or by any means that we should consider placing them within the 10th grade. And this brings up the, the way that grade level equivalent scores are often misinterpreted. They are often misinterpreted as conveying some type of information about what a student knows, what they can do, what content is appropriate, or even where they should be placed in school. And this is simply not the case. They are merely a reference to performance, and they are normed reference scores, which is why I have the shape of the normal curve distribution in the background. It's a, a distribution of scores. It lets you know where the student is uh, on a scale ranging from 0.0, .0 up to 13.0, and it is just that, a reference to performance. So when you look at grade level equivalent scores, say to yourself, this is a score that tells me something about performance. It is not a score that tells me something about appropriate content or by any means appropriate grade placement within school.